was the shit ride I've ever been on. Don't do it. 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 Shock. Charlotte's not ready. And we missed the train. come back from London, we had a weekend away, and we went to Winter Wonderland. The deposit for the mortgage I've been saving is gone. Nowhere to be seen, actually. But on the other side, it was very fun. So I've vlogged the whole day, and I'm going to show you exactly what it's like, and it's going to be a very honest review here on Winter Wonderland. Uh, I'm not going to be holding back, baby. Uh, just like they didn't hold back taking my money. I'm still not, I'm, you know what? I'm still not over it. There's nothing even in this cup, look, it's dregs. I can't afford any coffee. Right, starting the day off, we went to the circus. Completely unrelated to the circus, but Charlotte Turner, why does it take you one working week to get ready? Kicking it off, check this guy. I mean, that's phenomenal. I wouldn't recommend going with the boys, but going with the other half, no problem, until. Until these two little dickheads come out. <laughs> now these two guys are lucky they didn't get a smack in the chops. Have a look what they're wearing. Where's your top then? Charlotte didn't actually get her phone out very much, but funnily enough, when these two little knobheads came out, so did the phone. They had acrobatics, swinging around on ropes, Mad. And they even had little tiny men doing front flips on shoulders. Mad. So the circus, a-okay from me. Apart from them two guys, get your tops on. Please. When I think of theme park rides, I think of the waltzers. And they did not disappoint. Whiplash and a slip disc, but they didn't disappoint. It was all good. Common theme with the rides, I love them, Shah doesn't. <laughs> But to be fair, she still came on them. But yeah, the waltzers. You can't really get a bad one. It's like a Nando's. Unless you go to Deliveroo. But if you get a waltzers on Deliveroo, that's mad. Next, the games. I see a lot of man walking around with big teddies. I'm gonna have to win a teddy then. It's a scam! Nah, it wasn't a scam. I was just fucking shit at the game. Oh, oh, Callum! To be fair, a lot of the games, there's got to be some witchcraft because I don't understand how they work. But there was a lot of people with these massive teddies, so they are they are winnable. So it's not a complete scam. But I played the game, had to throw a dart, had to score six, scored six. Then he said I need more than six, so he gave me one more dart, and then I absolutely scuffed it. Oh! But to be fair to him, he let me have the teddy anyway, and here he is. Here, look, Winnie, he's called. You know, you know he wants the little teddy. He gave us the teddy anyway. No, 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 no. I want the teddy. I want you a teddy. The food. We didn't try all the food because we're not morbidly obese. But after winning that teddy, I built up a bit of an appetite. So Charlotte, she loves food, mac and cheese. It got the Charlotte Turner seal of approval, which it says a lot because that's not easy to get. I've been trying for five years. I've only just got there. Sample some beers. Mwah! I tried one of the Billy Bob's burgers. <laughs> Alright. And then sample some more beers. Mwah, mwah. Here comes the big boy. Top tier ride. What is it called again? Look at this. They are this. Munchin' Lupin. It's got like four loops on it. It's an absolute belter. I loved it. <laughs> so did Char. 
Okay. Now here it comes. The worst ride I have ever been on. Six pound each. It's a haunted house. Actually, it makes me quite emotional. I wasted my money on it. It was awful. The least scary, the biggest waste of money, the slowest. I had to queue for ages. I mean, I shouldn't moan. I'm trying to be positive, man. But honestly, nearly ruined the whole day. <laughs> that was the shittest ride I've ever been on. Don't do it. Well, that cost us six quid each. It was god awful. Avoid, avoid, avoid at all cost. Don't go on this ride. It is a complete scam. What they do when you're queuing up, you can see people coming off, and just out of sight is like a trap door, right? So when people have gone around this shit ride, and then they like fall over the trap door, they're like, oh my god, oh. My. So when you're queuing, you're like, man, they're creasing, they're coming off laughing. This must be good. They're clever. It's not good. The trap door makes you think that they're having fun when two seconds before they were trying to get a refund. Don't go on the ride. Right now, for the best part of the day, it's the. Hello? Dancing on ice? Can I do the show next year? Yeah, yeah, I'm pretty sure I can do it next year. What's that? I've got to do it blindfolded because I've got to make it fair for the other contestants because I'm that good at ice skating. No drama. No drama! The ice skating was sick. Bambi came with me. <laughs> but my only criticism, the people that work there, they are very good at ice skating, obviously. They're making sure everybody's okay, picking them up off the floor. But if you're going 750 miles an hour on the ice skates, zim, zim, zimming in between everybody, you're going to put them off and you're making them fall over. It's no rocket science, mate. Also, no phones. You can't take any videos, can't take any photos because they try and sell you them there. So do it on the slide, little sideways video, hide it underneath your tits, I don't know. <laughs> But and then finally we finished the day going on the big wheel to look over the park. Lovely view, absolutely amazing. Charlotte was absolutely shit scared, uh, which isn't her fault. She was scared uh, and didn't like it, so I was I was getting my arms squeezed off like the Hulk was there. It wasn't really for me. A bit of a waste of money. I wouldn't recommend the wheel. Unrelated to the Winter Wonderland, when we left, there was a guy beatboxing, and I caught this on camera, and I've got to show people. Right, check this out. So he's beatboxing, everyone's like, oof, oof, yeah, I love it. Some girl's going to give him a high five, look at this. Oh, no. Oh, no, I mean... Oh, shit, it's so bad. I mean, look at her face as well, she's shocked. <laughs> So, Winter Wonderland, couple questions. Will I go again? No, I've done it, I don't think I'll go again. Is it worth it? Yeah, but it's, it's very expensive, and don't go on that haunted house, because it's a scam. Anyway, thank you all for watching. If you did enjoy the video, please leave it a like rating. Subscribe to the channel if you're new, and I'll see you all next week. Safe. F*** that haunted house.